This is Lisa Bozarth Ozida, and in this video, we're going to look at the examine. St. Ignatius taught that at the end of each day, we should take time to pray and examine our whole day to see how God interacted with us that day and to help us gain focus for tomorrow. The examine has five steps. Before you start, find a quiet place and settle in with a notebook and a pen Take a few deep breaths and be prepared to connect with God. Step one, start the exam by recognizing that the divine is with you and has been with you. Pray that you will be open to seeing your day through God's eyes. Step two, give thanks. Gratitude is the foundation of our relationship with God. The day that you just lived is a gift from God. Even our worst days are still gifts. Give thanks to God, but be honest about how you feel. It's okay to say, God, thank you for this day, but it didn't feel like a good one. Starting our prayer with an honest conversation about where we are is important. It helps us to take the next step and allow God to open our eyes to see something new. With this openness, review your day slowly. Walk through each moment, each interaction, each response. Pay attention to the small things. Remember, where were the gifts present in your day? How did you receive them? How did you speak to others? Is there a time that you might have missed God in your day? Step three. A great gift that Ignatius gave us was the admonition to pay attention to our emotions. We can see how God was moving in our day when we reflect on our emotions. What emotions did you have today? Boredom, anger, joy? What is God saying through those feelings? As we review our day, it's common to recognize those times where we fell short. But take note and ask what might be deeper. What's the deeper meaning behind these feelings? For example, you might feel frustrated when God is telling you to try something new. But it might be time to give yourself permission to take time to learn something new. This frustration can then be turned into a recognition of a gift from the divine to experience new things, even if they take time to learn. Some instructions of examine focus on listing all of the sins for the day. Without proper perspective, this can suck the life out of us and make us feel further away from God. Instead, ask God to help you understand why you're responding to things that happen in your life and allow this to draw you closer to God, where you can see God in all things. Step four, focus on one thing. Find one thing in your day and journal about it. Talk to God about it. There's nothing to do here but be with God in conversation. Make sure to take the time to both speak and hear. The last step is to look forward to the next day. Review your calendar. What do you have planned? Pray and ask God to be with you and show you the divine in all things. In the examine with prayer, Ignatius teaches us that we should talk to God like a friend. You don't need to be formal. Just confess your sins, ask for forgiveness. Thank God for the time that you've spent in the examine. Do all of this with a heart of gratitude and in the examine with an Our Father. And I hope that the examine helps you to find God in all things.